Hardik Pandya has been uh, brilliant this season with the bat. Uh, whenever he's come to bat, he's been an impact player. Whenever he's come to bat, he's primarily played about 18 balls, about 20 balls. And each time he's played, he's striking close to about 200. And even this evening, I thought it was a magnificent innings. At one stage, I thought the match was over. 232 was way too many. But uh, Hardik Pandya had other plans. Hardik Pandya believed that this was possible. And he was batting like a man possessed. And these are good signs for India, not just for Mumbai Indians. India goes to the World Cup in about three weeks' time. And if he can bat like this and if he can still bowl the way he does, uh, the wickets in England will help him a little bit. But boy, Hardik Pandey, the all-rounder, is coming to the party. Great signs for Mumbai Indians and great signs for India. Uh, with uh, Andrew Russell, it's not more so about the number three or number four. I think uh, what's more important is that you give him enough time. He's somebody who has done well for KKR, who's batted exceedingly well. And uh, if you ask me, it's been more so a one-man show with the bat for KKR. Uh, there have been times when a few of the other batsmen have chipped in. Uh, Dinesh Karthik, an odd game. Shubman Gill, a couple of games. But uh, the one man that's been consistent for KKR has been uh, uh, Andrew Russell. And to me, it's important that if someone is in good touch, if someone is batting well, it's very important that you send him early. This is a format which you have just about 120 balls, and it's important that your best player gets to bat most number of balls. That's why they say normally opening is the best place to be in T20 formats, but I'm sure that Andrew Russell isn't someone who can open the innings, but yes, give him about 8 to 10 overs. Keep that in mind. Keep him flexible. Keep it in mind that if he gets to bat about 50, 60 balls, he will maximize. And we saw that this evening. Uh, 40 ball 80 uh, coming in at number 3. I just get a feeling that KKR might have found the formula going forward. I just thought Piyush Chavla bowled very, very poorly. Uh, if you go back and see the wagon wheel of uh, Hardik Pandya, though he batted beautifully, uh, primarily 90% of his runs were leg side and Piyush Chavla was feeding him there. He was consistently bowling the wrong line, consistently not bowling outside the off stump. But having said that, very happy with Sandeep Aurya on debut, bowled beautifully. Uh, but to me, five bowlers on a surface like this was one bowler shot. And I just get a feeling that going forward, you might need another bowler, maybe bring back a Kuldeep Yadav. Uh, Robin Uttapa never got to bat. Uh, Rinku Singh never got to bat. Hardik Pan, uh, I beg your pardon, Dinesh Karthik just about got to bat about five, six overs. They probably are playing one batsman too many. I just get a feeling with the kind of batting they have and the kind of batsmen they're just about getting into form, they can maybe leave out a batsman and play an extra bowler.